Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new YouTube video. And in today's YouTube video, we're gonna be going over the basically good and bad on the CF Moto here. I haven't done a full video on this thing ever on my channel. Matter of fact, you guys only really saw it in one video, and it was in fact the video when we sunk it. I'll have that one linked after. So you guys can go ahead and watch it. It's my best performing YouTube video so far. Yeah, this thing we only took it on a few trail rides, it only has 125 miles and we've already had a handful of problems with it so in today's youtube video i'm gonna be just letting you guys know about those problems oh who put that rock there we are fixing that right now I'm gonna fix that while we let this fucking machine warm the fuck up if you guys are curious on how the cf moto looks it's it's not a bad looking unit i wish the roof was a little lower because it sort of looks a little bubbled but what are you gonna do about it? Besides, move the fucking rock so I can do some sick fucking drift, bro. It's a little brisk today, guys. It's fucking. Fuck, last time I checked. Last time I checked, the weather was 31 degrees. She'll get up and go. She's a slow unit by any means. Alright, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go to the other side of the creek here. Now, basically. I'll park up, start talking about this. What the fuck? <laughs> when, when she's cold, she'll do that when you throw her in there. Okay. As you guys, the creek is up. The water's normally below those lines. I'll show you guys the deep hole over there that we took the renegade in. Fucking toss it on its ass. Right here seems like a good spot to stop and talk, I guess. Alright, so quick cut to when we're outside of this unit. Alright, so here I am. Gonna be talking about the good shit that's happened with this machine so far and the bad shit that's happened with this machine so far. So I'm gonna jump right into the thing that first thing when we first got it, first problem. So the stock seat belts, seat belts in this thing are fucking ass. They will lock up on you no matter no matter what. You don't even have to try to get them to lock up. It was ridiculous. So the first thing we did was put these harnesses in it. They're very good. Ace is racing. Make sure to check those guys out. They got good harnesses, man. What can I say? This cargo bed right here. It has all the drain holes, but they aren't recessed they have a little bump so you kind of can't get this thing fully clean unless you have this thing like tipped over upside down or some shit i mean i think we just got a lemon our dashboard right here i don't it's not doing it anymore i don't know why but it was it would fade all that shit so that that was a not good situation Ooh, one thing we so if you have your cf moto 800 ex Let's say you're buried in a mud hole. You're in a little bit of a situation. You go to go for your winch. Where in here do you see a winch? You don't. But it has a winch up front. So where the fuck's the button? Well, you have to open this thing. You have to reach over from your driver's seat into the glove box and grab this big ass catastrophe of a winch cable thing open this thing up and plug it in and then from there you can start winching now that really fucking sucks because if you're in a time struggle let's say eh, you're a little close to sinking like you might have had this thing we had her buried this whole seat was under first try <laughs> shit was good but yeah it would have been nice to get the winch out faster but we couldn't so that resulted in the exhaust cutting off underwater i mean thank god the stock exhausts on these things are like fucking gallons like a whole gallons of water so it started right up honestly surprised me i thought i thought we've done killed this thing on the first ride now this year thing this year unit will come with your tow hitch so you could tow your trailers your little logging trailers whatever you 
whatever tickles your fancy, whatever you want to do with this machine. Now in the front end, it has no sway bar, so you could have full articulation. In the rear end, it has a, it does indeed have a sway bar. You can see it right there. So you won't be able to get that full flex. I should, I think they should have just put no sway bars in the whole thing. That was badass. You have a storage compartment right here. I'll crack this unit open for you. It has a decent storage compartment there. It does indeed have a drain at the bottom. Now, if you're curious about where your actual intake slash factory snorkels are in this thing, God forbid you fucking bury it. Your, your belt exhaust is gonna be located like sort of right here in this general range. So we somehow didn't get any water in the belt when you had the seat owner. We were at a slight, slight tilt. So that saved us. Your air box is gonna be right here. So you probably take her around, yay, without her dying. And the belt intake is going to be up here. So you could go up to your like fucking belly button. And besides that, it's been a pretty reliable machine. <laughs> it only died on us once in the water. And guaranteed that was most likely 100% rider inflicted. But it's a pretty reliable machine. I mean, if you were to go buy something, Can-Am and Polaris are a little out of your expense range this thing will do the job just fine so enough bullshit talking of me stuttering like a motherfucker and cursing like i'm a sailor let's hop in this unit and do some dumb shit shall we so let me go over the what's the word the cockpit for you so you got your shifter here it's your average like can-am shifter well can-am four-wheeler shifter i know it's different in the mavericks but you got low all the way up front, then you got high, neutral, reverse, and park. You have a parking brake for when you're on a hill or some shit, so you don't slide back and have horrible shit happen. You got your kill switch right here, just flick of a switch, it's dead. I'll give you guys a little example right now. Dead immediately. You got the horn, it has a fucking horn, watch this. That's fucking sick. <laughs> you have your three, well, you have three different headlight options. You got you're off, you got your mid running lights, then you got your full on brights. Now here you could detect which way you want your lights to be facing, so you could either have it poked up or poked more down towards the ground. We run it down towards the ground. This is your reverse, reverse override switch, you can see it light up on the dashboard right there. That'll basically allow you to scoot a little bit in reverse. You got your four wheel drive and your four wheel drive and diff lock switch, you push this in. You hear it lock in, push that in, your four wheel drive will be locked in. Then you switch this thing over. If my autistic ass could do it. All right, so you flip that thing over. Then you got your, your diff lock for the front end. Yeah, well, really only the diff lock for the front end. So you press this. Now your front diff's locked. So you could rock crawl aggressively, mud aggressively, do whatever tickles your fancy. I'm gonna take these units off so now i say we just backyard rip a little bit shall we now you guys are going to see a lot of this machine in this coming one because it's going to get cold and we're going to ditch the dirt bikes for the winter so i'm going to be i'm going to be piloting the renegade my brother and my dad are going to be piloting this thing, so we'll be sure to get you some footage of how it does. Ooh, this looks like a fun little obstacle. So we're just going to do this in high two-wheel drive and see if we need anything. That will do it in high two-wheel drive all day. Let me just tip this thing because I probably am going to do that. <laughs> hey, yo! <laughs> Got a little close to that tree, don't you think? All right, a little bit of a tighter navigation for here. Um, what do you think? Double log cross this bitch? Fuck it. Okay. <laughs> Had to hit 
the force. There's a little bit of rock crawling going on here. I almost set the GoPro up. Alright, GoPro set up. Here we go. Yeah, a little bit of a crawling action. Set up this unit. We're going to initiate diff block here and try to maybe climb this big rock. Yo, I got this thing flexed out right now. Here's a good view at the North Way Barn action. It's not horrible in the rear end. We still got a Still got this wheel on the ground, surprisingly. We're gonna, we're gonna cut back to helmet tank. Let's take her to the abyss called the creek. Uh, I hope it's like a deep through here. Okay, it's getting a little deep. Not, not, not going front. Look at the bubble in right there. drive you see that shit okay so maybe it's a little deep let's see how let's see how deep this shit is Tarzan in this shit. Oh damn. Oh brother. <laughs> yeah, that got a little deep. We are practically ugly underwater right now. That goes to show you guys how deep the creek has gotten from that thing being damned off. Ow. H. Christ. Oh, holy fuck. This is fucking deep. The good news is, oh my lord. The exhaust is clear out of the water. That was my main concern. Holy fuck. Oh, I got her in there. Look at that. Oh, that. My feet are a little cold. Okay. I got MacGyver my way back into this thing. Open this door. Oh, no wonder I'm in butt feels wet. Watch 
right there. Oh, Lord. Jesus Christ, boys. <laughs> wow. Do I dare go more? We'll take her one more inch forward. Now I know exactly what's going to happen. I'm going to keep going forward. And then my ass end is going to sink down. And then everything is going to be under. <laughs> Let's back out of this. Drink, see if my little belt box aren't I? Oh my god. Oh, is that it? <laughs> Money. What? Oh, <laughs> that, that'd be why. I'm gonna set my camera right here and rev it up for you guys <laughs> so the water can piss out of it. on the renegade and show you guys how deep it is on the renegade Cold start this beast. Okay, this, this is how deep this thing truly gets. enough that we idle under the water. Look at that shit though. That is deep. That's deep now. Look at that shit. Let's see if Moto can never. wave <laughs> all right back in the CF moto <laughs> back <and> wicked <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
Whoa, buddy, <laughs> that was scary. She's in there pretty good, I'd say. <laughs> Let's get her out of here. Oh, shit! <laughs> Let's do that again. So, this is the end of this YouTube video. I hope you enjoyed my dumbassery in the side by side. You guys have never seen it in a full video. So, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.